What's up everybody? So today Rockstar released the first few informations about Red Dead Redemption 2 PC. So we're gonna take a look here at the Rockstar Newswire and we're gonna check out some of these new informations. I'm not gonna read everything we have here. I believe most of you can read and I'm gonna leave in the description here the link to the Rockstar Newswire. If you wanna read the whole thing, you can go ahead and read. I'm just gonna focus here on the most important things, right? So Rock Rockstar says here, Red Dead Redemption 2 arrives for PC November 5th. You can start today and you can pre-order the game exclusively via the Rockstar Games Launcher with the host of, of new addition and range of technical, graphical and performance enhancements to make Red Dead Redemption 2 PC the ultimate version of Arthur Morgan and the Dutch Wonderland Gang open world epic. Here are the first few news, new screenshots, PC screenshots, right? So here it says, from now until October 22nd, you can pre-order Red Dead Redemption 2 for PC exclusively via the Rockstar Games launcher and receive special bonuses, including two free, uh, two free classic Rockstar Games PC titles from the following. So basically you can choose two free games if you get the game on the Rockstar Games Launcher, and you can choose between Grand Theft Auto 3, Vice City, San Andreas, Bully, LA Noir, and Max Payne 3. That's a good deal. Th that that that's something good because all these games are great games. Anyways, uh, also says all pre-purchase made on the Rockstar Games Launcher. You can include also include free upgrades to the Premium Edition of Red Dead Redemption 2 with the special edition and ultimate edition both discounted by $20 each. So basically you can get the special edition and the ultimate edition for $20 cheaper. Also says additional pre-purchase bonuses with the Rockstar Games launcher includes the Outlaw Survival Kit for Story Mode, a new horse for story mode, a new treasure map for story mode, cash for story mode, and 50 gold bars for online. Nothing much there. Uh, new, uh, new features and updates. Right, now here it talks a lot about, you know, the world, the graphic, how beautiful it is. And we all expected the PC version to be beautiful in graphics. It says new graphical and technical enhancements for deeper immersion included increased draw distance for better navigation, higher quality global illumination and ambient occlusion for improved day and night lighting, high quality snow tra trails, improved reflection in deeper, higher resolution shadow at all distances, better texture, improved grass, texture, realism, plants, and animal. Like I said, you know, I'm not making a big deal out of this because, I mean, Red Dead Redemption 2, both on uh, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, the graphic is amazing. I mean, so far, I've never seen a more, more beautiful game than Red Dead Redemption 2 to this day. So I'm not making a big deal because we expect great graphics on PC, but that's what you get on PC, better graphics. Now here Rockstar says Red Dead Redemption 2 for PC also offers HD, HDR support, the ability to run high-end display setups with 4K resolution and beyond, multi-monitor configuration, widescreen configurations, faster frame rates and more. Now you can also click in this image to see the quality, great quality. Now here it says you're gonna get the Red Dead Redemption 2 on PC. You get three new bounty hunter missions, two gangs hideouts, two treasure maps, a new mission called To the End of the Earth, Collect Herbs. <laughs> Great name for a mission. What you have to do? Collect some herbs. Anyways, new weapons. You have the M1899 pistol, all new semi-automatic handgun with clip-loaded ammunition, Evans Repeater, which was available only for Red Dead Online, High Roller Revolver, which was also only available for Red Dead Online, Delamat Revolver, 
which was also available for Red Dead Online. So a bunch of weapons that, that already exist on Red Dead Online will be coming out to the story mode on PC. You get new horses, here are the horses, five new trinkets to collect with new effects, okay? And here's the PC specifications, right? And then also says, stay tuned uh, to the Rockstar Newswire for more Red Dead Redemption 2 for PC, including the new official 4K 60 frames per second trailer and for more informations and for more informations on all versions of Red Dead Redemption 2, head over to the official website. Right. This video is the first video I'm making on this channel in English. And I'm very disappointed that I'm not more excited for the first video, but I want to cover this this news. Now, why I'm not excited about this? Let's make one thing clear. I don't play on PC. Maybe that's the reason why for my lack of motivation on this news. I don't play on PC. But I believe that many of you that do play on PC, the chances are most of you, at least 50% of you, already played Red Dead Redemption 2 either on PlayStation 4 or Xbox One. Now, chances are you are very excited to play the game on PC with better graphics. But for me, myself, this is me. If I already played this game on, on a console, on Xbox or PlayStation, there is nothing new for me in this game on PC. Because, yeah, I would get better graphics on PC, but there is nothing that's gonna motivate me to wanna play the game again because the story is still gonna be the same even though you have a few new horses, a few new gangs hideout, you know, even though you have a few new missions, the story is still the same. There is nothing new. Now, what would make me wanna play the game again is if this version of the PC would come with an additional story a DLC for the story mode or an expansion that would that would make me want to play by the game again because I know that even though now I have better graphics new horses new gangs hideout but I would be excited because now I'm gonna see something new there is a new DLC story mode that I can play I can be excited so what's gonna happen now is this most of you that already bought the game either on Xbox or PlayStation will buy the game again because it's coming from PC, has better graphics, but you will still play the same game. The only difference is you will play the game with better graphics. That might be a good enough reason for you to want to buy the game again, but as it is now, I expected a bit more. And to be honest, this is my own fault because Rockstar never said they would make a DLC story mode. They never said none of this. In fact, they actually said that they are 100% concentrated on the online mode. So I create that ex expectation so I cannot hate the game and I cannot hate the players. It is what it is, but I expected a bit more. I mean, from now on, if you are new in the channel, the chances are if you're watching this video, you might be new. So if you are new and you like videos about Red Dead Redemption 2, Red Dead Online, or videos about, you know, games uh, from Rockstar, I would suggest you to subscribe here and hopefully you're gonna like and enjoy future videos. I promise you the, the other videos is gonna be much better than this. All right, thank you very much for watching. I see you next time. Bye bye. And you're not gonna take what they've got to give, and you're not gonna let them take your.